Uverse TV for only $29 a month for six months with DVR included. Summer means sleeves and slacks can't hide varicose veins. Vein Solutions, the vascular treatment and technology leader, introduces Vein Go, a groundbreaking safe approach to the treatment of the smallest of spider veins that aren't treatable with other therapies. So you'll feel your confident summer welcoming best. It's the only treatment of its kind in Central Texas. So schedule a screening today with our board-certified cardiothoracic and vascular surgeons. Sack the slacks. Liberate your legs at Vein Solutions. Caravan and Town and Country, still the best minivan ever built, starting at $29.98. And remember, I'll beat any competitor's price in Central Texas at Nile Maxwell Chrysler Dodge Jeep Supercenter, 620 and 183. I'm sorry I didn't get your name. Nikita. Want to know more about Nikita? Go to CWTV.com. Well, a controversial pet shop in South Austin closed its doors for the last time today. Petland has been accused of selling pets from puppy and kitten mills. Protesters have picketed the store almost on a weekly basis since it opened two years ago. Store owners denied the accusations all along but decided to shut up shop since they expect the city to pass a ban on retail sale of dogs and cats. Protesters said they weren't trying to close the place down, just hoping Petland would be more transparent about how they get their inventory. Shoppers on this final day say they'll miss the store. There was a lot of um, people that are sad. They just like to come in here and see the variety of animals that they had here. And um, you can tell the people who work here care about you. They remember us when we come back in, talk to the kids again. So, yeah, it's going to be missed. Petland owners say the closure leaves 20 people without jobs. All the pets that were for sale have been transferred to other Petland stores, none of which are in Austin.